Hey, what's up? What's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z. What is up, everybody? I am checking in with the collective, checking in with you guys for Taurus season. The moon is in Libra. I hope all is swell. Please like, subscribe, and share if you like the message and it resonates here. We're just going to get a quick intuitive message here for the collective, all signs included here, all right? Yeah, we're just going to get a general read here. I'm getting something about a uh, Gemini here, okay? Some message they're giving me about a Gemini. You could be a Gemini or you could be dealing with one here, okay? You could be this mature woman that was isolated in the past here, okay? I'm also hearing exiled, all right? This could have been self-imposed or, you know, it could have been imposed by outside forces here, okay? I'm also hearing un unforeseen forces here. So let's see what's going on here. I do see a Greek, okay? Somebody could be Greek, okay? Or you could be eating Greek food, all right? I do see, or there could be some type of meat and Greek, okay? I do see a group working hard, diligently here, okay? Now, this could be you working on some type of passion project here, or this could be outside forces working against you here, whether it's, you know, an institution, um, actual people coming together here. We'll see, okay? Putting in the consistent effort, all right? Could be dealing with a Virgo in the past, okay? Or past, present, or future here. But there's definitely some concern. There's a masculine energy here that's concerned here, all right? Let's see what's going on, Gemini. This could speak to communication here, third house. This could be about family, siblings, networking here, okay? You know, your circle here, friendships, all right? Let's just see what is going on. You could be trying to form, um, a, I'm here, formulate, okay? I'm also here, formulate a plan or a plot here, all right? That could speak to that group. But you could be trying to, you know, build a relationship here, okay? It could be the beginning of a relationship here, all right? So conversation here. You could be the topic of conversation. Let's see. I'm trying to see what I want to start with here, okay? You guys could be undecided, right? Gemini, but this is a um, collective read. Like I said, all signs included. But I'm getting a specific nudge about Gemini, all right? This could even be surrounding a relationship here, okay? All right, past, present, or future. Let's see what's going on here, all right? Mm -hmm. With the beautiful people, we have a full moon in Scorpio coming up on Friday here, okay? going to be very powerful here, okay? So we have a King of Cups in reverse here with the Queen of Cups at the top of the deck here. Okay, and the Hermit at the bottom here, all right? So this could speak to a breakup, a split up here, even a divorce here, because I have counterparts here. Somebody is very moody here, okay? Um, You know, I feel like there's a lot going on with the masculine's emotions here. It doesn't have to be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio here, but... You know, someone's really in their feelings right now, okay? King of Cups reversed with the Queen of Cups here. Okay, Hermit at the bottom of the deck. Like I said, you could be dealing with a Virgo, or this could be you. Um, Again, in isolation here, all right? You could be dealing with some type of heartbreak here. This could be past, present, or future here, all right? Mm-hmm. Child, somebody is emotional. Someone also could be um, emotionally manipulative here, Okay? But you're taking some time out. I'm hearing seclusion. You know, you're taking some time out for introspection here, all right? You know, just some quiet time, all right? Possibly to heal your heart or heal some emotions here. Three of swords with the queen of cups. Somebody definitely got their feelings hurt here, okay? Could be a mother figure here, all right? Could be, um, you know, a feminine water sign here, all right? But I feel like you're healing. With that Hermit energy and the Queen of Cups here, okay? There was some type of turmoil that went on, you know? King of Cups coming out reverse, first and foremost here, okay? I'm just getting moody here with the King of Cups here, okay? All right, Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck, Queen of Cups here. Yeah, and you healed here, all right? Um, you guys could be um taking a watch 
taking a watch, okay? Somebody's taking watch here, okay? It could be people taking turns taking watch here, okay? But or somebody could be watching the time here. But I feel like you could be taking a walk on the beach here with the Queen of Cups and the Ten of Cups here. Definitely could be in a, you know, a sunny climate um, here, all right? I'm just feeling, you know, vacation energy, but you definitely got the time that you needed to yourself here, okay? Because I feel like you're feeling renewed with the Ten of Cups here, all right? You're very emotionally balanced here. You got a, you gained a new perspective on something. Yeah, from the Two of Pentacles to the Ten of Cups, there was some type of rebirth that went on. You could be a Scorpio or you could be dealing with one here. Yeah, somebody was very unsure, uh, could be of a situation or themselves, Okay, after an ending here, all right, but I feel like you regain balance, um, you regain focus here, okay? Yeah, I'm loving that energy, Queen of Cups with the Ten of Cups here, okay? A lot of self-love, a lot of self-care here, okay? Being patient with yourself as well, all right? Are you, and again, you could be getting some sun, that helps uh, when it comes to emotional turmoil here. Yeah, this heartbreak had to do with a past situation here. Okay, King of Wands in reverse with the King of Cups in reverse. This could be two masculine energies or one. Uh, regardless, somebody was definitely like overdoing their manipulation is what I'm getting with the King of Wands. Like, geez, that is some nasty energy here for a masculine. I feel like something about this King of Wands in reverse and this King of Cups, it's giving me like somebody was in their feminine energy, but it was like a low vibration here. Like somebody was throwing a fit with the King of Wands and the King of Cups in reverse here. Okay, they couldn't get grounded or in control of their emotions or their lower region. Okay, with King of Wands in reverse here, okay. Yeah, somebody also could be power hungry here, okay, wanting control here, but can't control their own damn emotions here. Let's see what's going on, Two of Wands. Yeah, these are two masculine energies here, okay? It could have been two masculine energies that broke your heart in the past here, or there was just a very heartbreaking situation. But as of right now, it looks like they're heartbroken here, okay? Because they're coming up reverse. Queen of Cups with the Ten of, uh, Ten of Cups, you know... You're, I'm hearing a new bag here, okay? All right, you could have got a new bag here. You could have got a promotion here. But, you know, you're coming up feeling good, smelling good, looking good here with the Queen of Cups here. You could be sipping tea here, all right? Child, what is going on? Somebody's falling out here. These two masculine energies is what I'm getting here, a fire sign and a water sign. They're heartbroken about a situation from the past. This could be people that you grew up with. This could even be two masculine energies um, in your family with that Six of Cups energy. Okay? Could be childhood friends. Take it how it resonates. Child? Mm-hmm. Um, you guys could be, you know, spending a lot of time outside as we um we go towards the summer months here. It's just what I'm getting with that rainbow energy and that Ten of Cups. Okay? That Ten of Cups is just saying a lot here. Okay, you guys gain some type of emotional fulfillment, balance within self here, okay? With that hermit card, you really went within. Yeah, I'm seeing the seven pinnacles and the hermit card. So you did the work here. You could even did some type of shadow work on yourself. You invested into yourself here, okay? During this alone time here, during this me time with the seven of pinnacles and the hermit energy here, okay? And these two masculine energies, they just all over the place here. All right, child, what is going on? Yeah, here's the king of wands here. This person could be thinking about you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here, all right? Mm -hmm. Somebody could be in their feelings because they got caught cheating here, doing way too much with that king of wands in reverse here. Somebody's definitely drained here. Yeah, lovers with the, with the two of wands. I got the two of wands again here. Okay, so what the hell is going on? It could be um, a same-sex um, relationship going on here with the King of Cups and the King of Wands in reverse as well. Damn, they ain't even good to each other. What is going on here, okay? Mm -hmm. Or you just got two lovers, you know, contemplating um, a relationship of the past here, okay? 
they could be trying to make some type of decision here, but I'm getting two masculine energies definitely here. All right. I don't know if they're trying to, this could be two masks. They're just working together. They're trying to put their heads together here. But for some of you guys, this is a same sex relationship here. Okay. Yeah. Well, the fortune and the lover's energy here, child, what is going on? Here's that Gemini energy popping up. Okay. Right. Yeah. Somebody's worried here. Mm-hmm. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, because, you know, there's a completion here. There's an ending and then there's a completion here, okay? There, somebody could be intimidated here by your status here, all right? There's a faded event um, with these with this Gemini that's going on here, okay? What is this? Mm-hmm. Yeah, these two masculine energies definitely could be working together here behind the scenes here, all right? Could be some friction going on here. Somebody could be trying to block a love relationship here or a connection here, okay? Someone, you know, they have their defenses up. They have their, their guard up here, okay? There's some trouble in paradise. Hmm, Gemini. Okay. Yeah. Like somebody is deep in their thoughts here. Several scenarios. Okay. Yeah. Full card. So these two um, masculine energies could be collaborating together here. They're making a decision to have some type of exchange, money, time, energy, or resources to take a leap of faith here with the will of fortune here. Okay. So this could be a new endeavor here. Somebody could be traveling to new places, new lands here. All right. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius or a Pisces here. Okay. Mm -hmm. well, someone's definitely um, taking a leap of faith here. They could be having to, you know, spend some money here or invest some uh, resources or finances here when it comes to this leap of faith. Okay. Could be seeing 666. Hmm. Again, this could be the two people who are collaborating together here. All right. Yeah. So you definitely have two masculine energies that are collaborating together, whether um, they are, you know, in an intimate relationship or not here. Okay. You got a king of cups and a king of wands that's working together here. Okay. To get a new beginning. Okay. Yeah. I feel like, some, I feel like they're trying to get unstuck here. Okay. Yeah, this is about an investment here. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody's trying to get a rebirth here. Could be dealing with the Scorpio here. Or like I said, you could be dealing with the Pisces here. All right. But I'm also hearing startup here. All right. Someone's trying to get something off the ground here. All right. Mm-hmm. I don't know. There's a lot of stuck energy here. Okay. Because they want this Ace of Pentacles energy. They're collaborating together here, all right, to get this Ace of Pentacles energy here. They're definitely weighing their options here, all right? Trying to put their little heads together here for this new beginning. Hmm. Yeah. I'm looking at their options here, okay? Trying to invest into something long-term. They could, could even be doing some research here with the Knight, Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Swords here, okay? They're trying to get the best outcome here, all right? Hmm. So this what this could be about this lover's energy, Gemini energy here, okay? Mm-hmm. What's going on here? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Somebody can have some type of wish fulfillment here to block you here, collective here, okay? Something about your strength, you could be dealing with the Leo here, okay? Yeah, chariot here Um, after that, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, someone could be, someone is definitely could be traveling, could be taking some type of transportation, a train, a bus here, all right? Mm-hmm. Their wish fulfillment here is to possibly, you know, like stand in someone's way here, okay? With the nine of wands energy here, okay? I'll just create a blockage here, okay? Mm-hmm. They could be trying to block some type of balance 
from coming into play here. Yeah, Justice card, Ten of Pentacles with the Strength card here, all right? Definitely could be dealing with a Leo, could be dealing with a, a Libra or a Capricorn, all right? I got Aquarius checking in as well. All the signs are here, all right? Mm -hmm. Let's see what's going on, Joe. What these two knuckleheads got going on? I'm getting a lot of traveling here. Right. Mm, yeah. Somebody could be lurking in the shadows as well with that death card in that Knight of Pentacles, Page of Swords. You know, collective, you'd be having a lot of people, you know, spying, riding, you know, past your house here, constantly day in, day out here. All right. Trying to spy on you, see what you got going on, following you to and from here. Okay. Because see, somebody stressed the hell out here. Okay. This Gemini, somebody's carrying burdens here. Could be trying to stress you out, okay? Trying to place these burdens on you here. What is this about here? Yeah, temperance energy. There's the sign. I said we could be dealing with the Sagittarius here, okay? So we got Sag and Scorpio stepping into the chat room, okay? Could be a Sag, a Sag, okay? Mm. Could be a, a Sag and a Scorpio working together as well as a Pisces here, okay? Mm -hmm. Traveling, okay? Spying, mm-hmm. Could even be following you here. All right. So. So two masks. That's what they want. What's, what's the deal here? Okay. What is the deal with these two masks and the energies? Because, you know, they're heartbroken. So they're heartbroken about a situation from the past. So they decided to link up here. Okay. Having some type of exchange, money, time, energy, resources could even be intimacy here. Um, but their goal is to get unstuck here. Okay. Uh, I feel like there's travel involved here. All right. Mm -hmm. And, you know, somebody has some type of sinister, um, what could I say? Wish fulfillment here to place a blockage here. Okay. They're definitely working together, you know, steadfast here with the three of pentacles here they want a new beginning they want to get unstuck here so let's see how this works here because they want to get unstuck they're having a strategy of trying to get unstuck by getting you stuck here okay or by blocking you here okay so somebody wants to do some type of switch a rule here okay that's cute <clears throat> what is going on here well, we got this queen of cups with the ten of cups you minding your damn business here okay you know, possibly regaining your strength. We did see the strength card here. Um, we could have something to do with some legal matters here. All right. You could be getting a payout here with the Ten of Pentacles and the Justice card here. Or this could just be justice, spiritual inheritance here. Okay. Um, you know, a well of abundance, infinite well of abundance here. All right. Mm-hmm. Child, we got two week, two two of the weakest links linking up here. Is that what's going on here, Spirit? Let's see. Mm -hmm. So this is about two lovers here. Oh, imprisonment here. Oh, okay. Well, okay. Somebody is um not too successful here, okay? For some of you guys, somebody already could be in prison here, but imprisonment came out here. Wow. Okay, somebody could go to jail at night here, okay? There's some type of message traveling at night here. So I don't know if somebody's trying to travel towards you here, okay? With that scorpionic energy, nine of pentacles in the page of swords, imprisonment here. So somebody's trying to get out of jail is what I'm getting here, okay? Trying to get you in jail, that's not going to work here, okay? They're working hard together, honey, to try to get a new beginning here, okay? They're working hard together. Uh -huh. While you over here sipping your tea here. All right, getting some sun. Oh, thief. Okay. Somebody's a thief here. This could be somebody in the religious community, child. Okay. Could be have something to do with the main uh, female involved in the situation here. So somebody's going to jail because they're a thief here. They could have a cover. Of like a, 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 a preacher, a pastor, or a rabbi here. Yeah, somebody, you know, they, they reaped the harvest, but it was the wrong damn harvest here because it's landing their ass in jail, prison possibly here. What is this reverse? Oh, the gift reverse. I'll be damned. 
Mm -hmm. And landed on the six of cups here. Okay. So I'm hearing something got retracted here. All right. So, you know, these people were heartbroken here. I don't know if they wanted this gift from you here. But it came up reversed. This is why they out here with the Three of Swords and the Six of Cups here. Because something about, um, you know, them not getting this gift is heartbreaking for them here. Okay? I feel like somebody needed a way out of a situation here. All right? Thieves. Hmm. Thieves, thieves, thieves. One more um spin here. All right? Ooh. Mm-hmm. So they wanted this great fortune here. A mature man. Okay. Yeah, but a change. I heard a change gonna come here. Okay. Ciao. But a, a, a change is here. Okay. Okay, I see a feminine energy here. You could be getting some communication as well here. All right. Could be something about a date. There could be something changing when it comes to the dating scene or your love life here. Okay, you could be reminiscing about somebody here. All right. Mm -hmm. Someone's someone wants to spark some type of change here. Okay, if you're a feminine energy, I definitely feel like somebody could be reaching out to you. Could be sending you some message, something old fashioned here. The way about the way this person reaches out to you here. Somebody wants to like anchor you down here okay but someone else, someone else is also anchored down in poverty here okay so could be a change coming to uh, a feminine energy here all right hmm. see what's going on yeah they they were they thought that they were going to get this gift of great fortune here this mature man but that didn't happen here so this is why they're heartbreaking heartbroken here so this is all over money and somebody's heart is breaking Please. Uh-huh. So something they did because I feel like somebody wasn't su um successful in regards to actually getting the great fortune, but something they did is still landing their ass in prison. So it could have been the actual plot, plan, or scheme, something that they're already guilty of, though. Okay? Child, sure, please. Oh, I'm a collective is so tired of this energy here, all right. Mm -hmm. Somebody could have traveled to watch you here, okay? With the death card, the nine of pentacles, and the page of swords. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Somebody was trying to make a decision when it could come in and possibly end something. Take that how it resonates here. Definitely could be dealing with the Scorpio here, okay? Could be trying to plot and plan on your death. Yeah, this is probably why they ass is going to prison here, okay? They already left out in the cold because they didn't get this gift here. They're in the judgment here, possibly for trying to plot and plan somebody's murder here, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And now it's lots of fucking confusion going on here. Okay, Five of Wands landed right on the um, imprisonment card here. Okay, it could even be a fight inside the prison. Cause I'm hearing riot here. Okay, because there's lots of confusion. Three of Swords. And somebody's heartbroken here. Okay, they fighting about this judgment here. This person has already been judged in the spiritual realm. So there's nothing that they can do. They can plot, plan, scheme link up with whoever they want to link up but you know their file is their their file is just getting fatter okay by the minute it's nothing they can do here okay um last spin so this is about some lovers with that gemini energy here yeah ten of cups here yeah emperor's energy and then he, again who you here you are Okay, somebody's spying on the Empress. But this Empress energy, this is the same energy I'm getting with the Ten of Cups and the Queen of Cups here. Here you are, minding your business here, all right? Nurturing oneself here. Yeah, Ace of Wands with the Four of Cups here. Yeah, somebody's very dissatisfied here, all right? These two masculine lovers here, okay? They thought they had a bright idea here, okay, to get some type of Come, I don't know, come back here, okay? To try to restore some type of wish fulfillment to their lives, to their timeline here, but it's not happening with the Four of Cups here, okay? Mm hmm. Try, sure, please. All right, Collective, that has been a reading. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.